All right, Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all praise to Yahweh by Shema Shah by Shema Rakagradash. I want to give double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone, Rubo, and Tichbo. And I want to say Shalom by Bakwarim to the hopeful elect. All right. <clears throat> a uh, finances is a big thing in the sense of watching America fall. All right. Now, you're going to see an example of in this article that I'm going to read a little bit of, and then I'm going to get some other articles on the U.S. dollar. All right. Um, when the country has no money to stand on, that's when the country is, uh, at, is, is at its worst. All right. That's just my personal opinion, because if the money doesn't have any, if the country doesn't have anything to, uh, spend, how's it going to live? All right. How, if a person doesn't have anything to, you know, barter with or trade with, how are they going to live? All right. Cambodia to replace U.S. currency with black blockchain Salakia platform. All right. Cambodia is one of the most dollar reliant economies in the world. And its pending introduction of blockchain payment platform has caused small panic. All right. Hey, this black torn, this blockchain payment platform is going to, you know, until you having a digital wallet and a digital wallet is going to be a small chip that's going to be implanted in you, man. All right. Blockchain is a digital system allowing instant payments for a transaction of any size. And with it, the National Bank of Cambodia says that it plans to phase out the U.S. Phase out the use of U.S. ones, twos and five Federal Reserve notes by august 31st so they're phasing out money man all right let's i'm gonna look up uh, on my computer over here what does it mean to phase out something all right phase out an act of discontinuing a process project or service in phases all right so they're phasing out the U.S. dollar, man. And the phase in which they're doing it, they're starting off with the small notes, man, okay? The ones, twos, and the fives. All right? The confused, this confused local communities and triggered rumors that the use of the threes, $3 bills would be banded. That's their only worry, all right? The $3 bills are going to be banded when these people are about to institute an RFID microchip worldwide, all right? The controversy started when Chia Sari director of the National Bank of Cambodia said in the Khmer Times on May 28th that the blockchain would be the local economy less would make the local economy less reliant on the US dollar. All right. Everybody's starting to hate the whore, man. All right. Everybody's starting to hate the whore. Now I'm gonna look up what blockchain means. What is exactly blockchain? Blockchain is all right. I just on Google it says a blockchain is a decentralized, distributed, and oftentimes public digital ledger that is used to record that is used to record transactions across many computers so that any involved record cannot be altered retroactively without the alteration of all subsequent blocks. All right, this is how does blockchain work? A blockchain is a type of diary or a spreadsheet containing information about transactions. Each transaction generates a, a hash. If a transaction is approved by a majority, by a majority of the nodes, then it is written into a block. Each block refers to the previous block and together make a blockchain. All right, I'm gonna go one more. What is a blockchain in simple words? <clears throat> in the simplest term, blockchain can be described as a data structure that holds transactional records and while ensuring security, transparency, and decentralization networking, I'm gonna look it up. 
You can also think of it as a chain or record stored in forms of blocks, which are controlled by no single authority. All right. To give you some, get to give you what decentralized means. All right, decentralization is the transfer of authority from central to local government. <clears throat> All right, uh, let's see what decentralized dollar is. All right, this decentralized currency or peer-to-peer -peer money is a bank-free method used to transfer wealth or ownership of any other commodity without the need of a third party. All right. <clears throat> so these people are getting rid of the U.S. dollar. All right. And uh, this is showing the fall of America, man. All right. Countries are getting rid of the currency of America, man. All right. Um, let me see. Where was I at? Slaki. All right. Within days, Prime Minister Hun sent Clairfield to the paper that the U.S. To, to the paper that the U.S. currency was not banned and still widely used, adding a caveat in the event of a halt to the circulation of the said U.S. bills. An official announcement from the U.S. Bank. Cambodia will be released to the public. All right, so they they either plan on stopping the circulation of money, all right, or they just, yo, America's done, man, okay? That's what I'm going to say. All right, if the people is refusing your money later on, they're going to refuse you. All right, uh, he added, all citizens, please continue spending freely that the banknotes in the kingdom in the kingdom without any loss in exchange rates or additional charges. <sighs> the remarks did not stop the panic. Uh, the Times, Kimmer Times, observed that merchants in Fom Fin's Kindle market did not want to accept one bill, one dollar bills, lest there be render useless in the coming months one told the times yeah because if they're going to be rendered useless in the coming months how are they going to make anything off of it all right they're not going to get any uh it's not it's not going to bring them any growth into their company all right because the dollar is useless it's showing you that the dollar is useless anyway that if all these companies are going to uh well all these countries are are devalued the dollars already devalued they getting rid of the dollar slowly but surely how much more is going to hit America just like that, man? And, and within a week or within a day, you know, they're going to say, hey, the dollar no more. Come get this chip. All right. Right now, they they showing you that the dollar is worth nothing, man. All right. These countries are getting rid of the dollar. And they're going into blockchain, man. All right. It's, which is going to be a digital currency. All right. Let me keep reading. Did not want to accept the $1 bills lest they be rendered useless in the coming months. One told the Times he would not accept them for fear of being stuck with them in the future. Some gas stations and tuk-tuk drivers were also refusing them. The desire to phase out the low-value U.S. currency is understandable, even though they are officially recognized as tender. They are being they they are difficult and costly to manage and transport. The Cambodian bank is establishing a three-month period from. 1 June to 31 August for banks and micro finance institutions to collect ones, twos, and five dollar bills so it can be sent to a foreign country. There will be no service charge during this period. After 31 August, the cost of exporting the notes will be for the institution. There will be no charge for accepting ten dollar notes, and the bank will no negotiate with banks and microfinance institutions the exact date to stop accepting the small U.S. banknotes, all right? So you see that these people are not accepting this U.S. dollar, man, all right? 
there was some other, something else popped up on the bottom about uh hmm. all right anyway let me get some more all right because uh last year russia uh it came out russia was gonna get rid of the dollar man all right all right this is in rudders all right mm. this came out in November 2019, Russia will reduce our right, Slovakia. It says Russia to cut shares of U.S. dollars in National Wealth Fund. I don't know if this is. Nah, this ain't. Here we go. All right, Russia. This is on. South China Morning Post, and this came out last year, January 2019. All right. <clears throat> uh, Russia and China plan to ditch the U.S. dollar and switch to local currencies in international trade, but yet another delay to the new system for yuan rupel settlements show that show that just how complex the development how how complex it is to develop an alternative to the greenback all right so came out that russia all right and china's gonna um get rid of the dollar man all right here goes something on forbes u.s uh donald trump's china nightmare is coming true for the u.s dollar <sighs> u.s president all these ads man u.s president Donald Trump's power struggle with China, perhaps the defining future of his presidency until COVID-19 pandemic struck. All right, let me see. Hang on. The pandemic is subs and subsequent lockdowns crashed global con global markets and pushed investors around the world to the safety of the almighty dollar. All right, it was coerced. All this, all these things was it was planned for this. All right, but the U.S. dollar's days as the world's reserve currency could be numbered with the biggest ever changes to government backed central bank currencies looming and China, the lead, the leading field. All right. They want to keep giving you stimulus money, but this money is about to be worth nothing. Digital currencies will work just like regular coins and notes issued by central banks, but exist entirely online. All right. Hey, it sounds like a chip to me, man. All right. Instead of printing or minting currency, the central banks will issue, issue digital dollars via online accounts. Employees could theoretically pay directly into these government run accounts on both online and physical stores could and both online and physical stores could accept payment for them. Foreign exchange could also be handled through them, easing the flow of international trade. All right. Look, the dollar is done, man. OK. All right, the dollar's done. All right, let me let me show you some microchip and get some scriptures. All right. Look, man, here it goes, man. This is what your digital dollar's going to be on, okay? People are already getting chipped with this throughout the world man all right <clears throat> don't take this chip man all right because this is going to be the death of you literally by fire man through the spirit power you how about your mouth shot um this is revelations chapter chapter 13 verse 16 and he causeth all both small and great rich and poor free and bond to receive a mark in their right hand and in their foreheads and that no man might buy or sell say that he had the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name all right hey how about shima shy ain't playing man all right don't take this chip man all right because you see that all these countries are getting rid of the dollar all right this is revelations uh 14 and um nine and the third angel followed them saying with a loud voice, if any man worship the beast and the image and receive his mark, 
in his forehead or in his hand the same shall drink of the wine of the wrath which is poured out without mixture unto the cup of his indignation and he shall be tormented with fire and brimstone in the presence of the holy angels in the presence of the lamb all right i'm gonna keep reading and the smoke of their torment ascendeth up forever and ever and they have no rest day nor night who worship the beast and his image and whosoever received the mark of his name all right so if you you receive that mark man you're gonna be you're gonna be done for man all right the torments of hell man all right that's what fire and brimstone is man all right there's not no place where you go down beneath the earth all right and uh you burn with a with a red looking guy with a pitchfork all right with horns nah man you're gonna be burning on fire man okay like Sodom and Gomorrah was all right all right <clears throat> the second death man all right because you take the rfid microchip because you worship this beast system man all right uh it's gonna be thermonuclear uh fire man all right The potential application of thermonuclear heat depends mainly on the temperature required. With the reactor output, temperature is up to 700 degrees Celsius. All right, seven, what's, what's that? Seven, seven. That's 1200 and that's 1,290 degrees Fahrenheit, all right? The wide range of possible application at 900 degrees Celsius, the further possibility is at 950. So let's see, 950. That's 1,740, 1,740 degrees Fahrenheit, all right? That's a lot of heat, man, okay? All right. Look, the point is, man, you're gonna you're gonna get messed up by these um, thermonuclear missiles, man. You take this chip, you fall for whatever gimmick or any trick that they have lined up for the people to take these dollars to take this uh, fake to take these chips, man. All right, you see it, the dollar's falling, man. America is falling. Kwame Asherah and the Barber Boss, Shalom.